you believe that the body or we, you know, I have to be careful with my terms now, you know, that we, humankind, if you like, has the ability to, to heal itself? In other words, we have, you know, if we believe in, let's say, the infinite potential, the infinite ability that the quantum physicists tell us, effectively from a metaphorical but also I think from an energetic point of view that is in a sense part of our makeup. Um, does that not mean that you know we can you know we, we can heal ourselves? Um, what's your take on that? And, and if so, why do we need to go to a doctor or indeed dare I say to you or to anyone else to to be quote unquote healed? Wow, there's so many different aspects to that question. <laughs> Sorry to, yeah. yeah. I'd like to take the medical aspect first. Okay, you cool. You know, um, because I, as a healer, it's my, I, I believe it's very important to work with medical practitioners. Right. And uh, why, why is that? Well, because I think it's important. They, there is a long history of supporting patients, and they have a very specific training to do with. Um, which to support patients, right? And um, whilst I don't necessarily, um, I, ex I uh, because what you do I is exercise. really sort of almost correct me if I'm wrong is almost the opposite of what they do, isn't it? Well, sense? I exercise personal choice about medications that I take myself. Okay, but I don't necessarily encourage others to do the same because it is about personal choice. Right, right. And I will never um, say to somebody you shouldn't go and see a doctor mm. because um, I also don't believe in burying one's head in the sand. Mm. You know, um, these um, the, the the medical uh, the, the standard medical. Uh, system has been set up to support healing, to support the healing mm. of people. Mm. And if you have an opportunity to go for healing, um, I don't, I'm not prejudiced against somebody taking that choice or that choice. Right. You know, it's and in each, up to each individual to support their own healing process. Mm. And for me, I don't, as long, if a person is healed, and they do it through normal medical means, I will celebrate as much as I will through, through, stand, through right. the healing methods. Okay. I suppose as a healer, what I'm, what, I'm, what, what I'm practicing is that I'm saying there's much more than meets the eye mm. in terms of uh, disease. Mm. And I'm actively interested in that. I'm actively promoting that for myself, mm. and I want to support others who mm. want to support themselves over and beyond what they might do right. um, medically. Yeah. And uh, but I will never be an advocate. I, I may disagree, and I often do because I have a mm. family. I come mm. from a family of doctors, mm. and I often disagree mm. um, with uh, my family over particular treatment forms of treatment. Mm. But I will never say to somebody, "Don't do this, don't do that." Isn't there a I will, danger I will though? Place yeah. a recommendation, perhaps, but I, I yeah. will never because as a healing practitioner, we are not. Um, medically qualified right. and I will I will never seek yeah. to um, you know uh, I want to support the healing of patients this mm. is not about taking an adversarial stance and no, going, no, no. my system is better than your system mm. what I'm doing is I'm holding out my hand and saying hey mm. there's another side of this let's work together mm. and that's where I come from because as soon as I step into an adversarial stance I, fa I feel yeah. I failed myself yeah, yeah. and I failed the person I'm working with. Okay, well, let's come back to that because I think, you know, maybe there's a way where, you know, the adversarial aspect, if you like, maybe falls away, in theory at least, mm -hmm. but we'll come back to that. But what's your take on the bigger picture? I mean, what, what's your take on this, you know, the statement I made earlier that we can, in effect, heal ourselves? Mm. I really do believe where you look is where you go. Mm. Uh, I fundamentally believe that oh. and I've proved that in my own healing process oh. and um, that's sort of what I alluded to when I said if we work from the basis of the disease look, looking at that and analyzing the disease oh. then there's going to be no opportunity to raise one's head and look into the look into um, essence or look into right. goodness or mm -hmm. purpose mm -hmm. and I believe healing comes from a different place, not from necessarily mm. the place of disease. Mm. And it's about, as a healer, what I want to do is support people to move beyond 
their disease, mm. where they can connect with their essence mm. and their own inner goodness and their purpose in life, mm. and really feel the aliveness mm. of life, mm. to, and allow that to support them. Mm. Because I truly believe that one's healing is in one's own hands. Mm. Mm. And the reason I say that, and it has many levels, that mm. statement, mm. but it is about making a choice mm. for healing. Mm. We have, as individuals, and we've been brought up in particular ways, there are many forms of unconscious self-sabotage. Mm. And I think the exploration of that is quite useful, mm. and I've done it myself. Mm. And when it comes to healing, it's about mm. saying, okay, fine, that may be, that mm. may have been, but my choice is something different. Mm. I choose mm. life. Mm. Because mm. when one chooses life mm. at every mm. level of one's being, mm. then, then that's when true he mm. healing mm. can take place. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I, in terms of the quantum, I'm not a quantum physicist and I don't claim to be. But um, what I do know is that in the experimentation that they've been doing, is when you observe reality, it changes. And I'm wondering, um, we also, I'm involved in teaching a quantum leadership program, mm -hmm. which looks at exactly that, oh, right. is, 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 is how can we really take back our power to choose mm. our own lives mm. and influence our, our lives through ourselves. Mm. Mm. And um, that uh, it's a particular area I, I absolutely love because mm. I truly believe that um, we are in charge mm. of our own healing process. Mm. And it's only by connecting with our essence, connecting with our mm. purpose, connecting with grounding and spirit, mm. and really moving away from um, the place which is self-reflecting on the disease itself, which okay. lies yeah. at a different level. Um, but we have well-worn paths in our beliefs that take us directly back to that. You know, the, the good energy comes in and then it, it goes back to the, to, to the place of disease. Yeah. And it's really about slowly redirecting. So disease is, is, is influenced by our belief system, if not the Absolutely. product of our belief system. Absolutely. Right. I okay. believe that to be true. Yeah. And um, it's interesting I say that, I believe that to be true, because what I believe is also true. Mm. But yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, that's, a set, uh, that's mm. something for a, a longer conversation perhaps. Mm. But um, um, disease, if we have uh, beliefs of self-sabotage, that we're not good enough, that's going to have an impact on the psyche, it's mm. going to have an impact on the, uh, the energy system, it's going to have an impact on our physical body. Yeah. And if we're running those beliefs no matter how unconsciously, and um, we try and put a plaster over it, and we actually don't believe, don't deal with those underlying beliefs or mm. recognize mm. what they are. Mm. Then they're always going to be running us. Mm. 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 And whilst I don't believe in the complete analysis all the time, because I think that is not necessarily helpful. Yeah. Um, everybody, um, I think, needs to take. I mean, some people refer to it as the hero's journey. You know, you go yeah. out of your, you come out of yourself, you go on your healing path. And then often the answer is just exactly where you left it. But it was important to take that path to come back to self. But it's only through taking the journey do you realize that the journey was not necessary. Mm -hmm. So it's innately important and yet unnecessary at the same mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm.